morning, good afternoon, and good night. This is the unboxing for the PS4, the Sony PS4, which many people already have. <laughs> uh, but we're gonna do the unboxing here. I'm really excited about the PS4. My all-time favorite system is the Sony PlayStation series. So um, um, here we go. So see it here. Comes with a nice box. Put it right here. Best place to play. It has some of the characters: uh, Assassin's Creed, uh, um, uh, Watch Dogs, and this is the famous uh, Second Son. And this one I can't remember who it is. So it's one of the um, Sony-only games. It's called Crack or Keep or something like that. I can't remember his name. Um, to play to play online, you will require a PlayStation Plus membership, which I don't have. And I'm not planning to have for some time. I usually do my gameplay um, locally campaigns, and I already have a PS3 and an Xbox 360. So it has the 500 gigabytes, and it's the Jet Black. I don't know if there are other versions, probably there are other versions coming up soon, if they haven't already. Alright, so let's see how I can open this. Now I'll, I'll be trying the game with uh, Tomb Raider, the Definitive Edition. It's a great game and uh, I've seen a lot of it in YouTube and it's funny because it's like full circle as uh, when when I bought my first PlayStation, the PlayStation 1, which was just called PlayStation, uh, Tomb Raider 1 was the first game I, I bought it with, so I'm glad they, they did this again. I broke all the locks, um, but let's see. The same here, maybe. There we go. Okay. This is the new controller. nice this turns different colors depending on the user this is the USB port to charge it okay right. and uh, difference between the previous controller for the PS3 there are some difference here obviously the shape um, it's different they have uh, uh, different joysticks here the arm uh, feel better on the fingers, on the thumbs uh, but the biggest difference is I think this is audio it's a little speaker here, I believe, I'm not sure um, but the biggest differences are uh, it has a headset plug in here um, and uh, it has the this little pad here so it's a, kind of like a track pad like in your laptops so you're gonna be able to use this for some of the. I'm, I'm curious how developers are gonna use this for different games, and it has the this share button. So if you want to share something you have played because it's pretty cool what you just saw, you can just click here and it will uh, upload uh, the last few minutes of gameplay. I think you can define after you click here share button you can define uh, when does it start what you're gonna share and all that which is very cool okay this is the remote control it feels light and very nice has uh, a little surface here that like it's, it's, it's not slippery so that's nice and um, it's wireless right so it's a pretty cool controller the bumpers feel better too 
Okay. Let's see this. This is the quick star guide. Okay. Welcome to the war of PlayStation. Okay. And uh, we will open this some. Because this will help us install the PlayStation. So this is what it comes with. Quick start guide. Getting started. Connect the PlayStation 4 system to a TV. HDMI. Yada yada yada. Okay. Alright. So that's that. Let's instructions. Connect the dual shot. Okay. That's about it. Perform initial setup. Which if it's like the PS3 is gonna take like an hour. Anyway. Then you have it in English and what is this French? Yeah, French. And screw Spanish, right? <laughs> Just English and, and French. So <laughs> that's funny. Okay, and then this is the safety guide. Alright, yeah. nobody cares about this, right? So. Okay, so let's see. What is this? Uh, how do I get this out? Oh, cables. Fantastic. So I guess this is the power plug. It doesn't come with a uh, like box like uh, the Xbox, which is always funny. And. This is probably the USB. USB that goes into the controller, maybe. Maybe. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah. Goes here. Okay. So. All right. Um. I've always liked that the PS3 and the um, PS4 now, you don't need batteries. Like in Xbox 360, you need to put batteries, and you will have to be either recharging the batteries or buying no batteries. I like this much more efficient. I think the Xbox One will not have batteries either, but I'm not sure. All right, anything else here? Yes. Our cable. This is the HDMI cable. So we're gonna be using this one. Alright. So that's the HDMI cable. Okay. <coughs> Let's go for the best part. Ta da da Ta da 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 Ta da 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 Ta -da -da -da. Uh, there we go. It's much smaller than the original PS3. Much smaller, obviously. Um, it's lighter, but I believe it's similar to the slim version of the PS3. I don't know because I don't have one. I have the original PS3, still alive. Well. Still alive and kicking, kind of. And this is the PS. Looks amazing. It's pretty. Looks like a machine from the future. It only has two USB ports. My PS3, the original one, came with four, so you didn't have to buy any adapters. For rock band games and stuff like that. Okay. What is this? Okay. This looks weird. I think it is like that, but it looks a little weird. Um, it has the PS4 
logo in the back as well. Okay. It has all the ports here in the back. HDMI, Ethernet, in here. What is this? It's like a USB maybe for memory. Okay. And the power adapter here. You see? It's too dark. Yes. This side's better. Yeah? Yeah, much better. Okay. So that's the USB. Uh, Ethernet or internet. And uh, I think this is USB port. I'll have to figure that out. And then the power supply. Okay. It's beautiful. Now it gets fingerprints very easily. That's not cool, Sonny. Um, but that's the shiny finish that it has. So you can use it standing like this. Okay. This will be the front. Or you can use it like this. But to use a standing, you need to buy a little stand. Okay, so we'll use it like this for now. Okay. Has the PS4 logo here too. And I have no idea where the CD goes. Okay, it goes here. Pretty dark. Hmm? It's really dark. Can you see it here? Yeah. That's the, where the CD goes, and it only has two USB ports. I'm sorry that you know they could have put more USB ports here, probably, but they want to use the cell adapters as well. Mm. The PS3, the original one, it had four uh, USB ports, and then when they brought the newer versions, they uh, reduced it to, to only two. Okay. Let's see if there's anything else in the box. I don't think so. Let's put it here. That will be the unboxing. Yes. Empty box. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Really dark. Um, so that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. The unboxing of the P Sony PS4. See you guys.